Good morning and happy Monday everyone. Yago Grahimov here and I want to again touch base my favorite subject Bitcoin. But when I look into the market nothing has really changed from the price perspective since our last video on Friday. So if you want to know my technical analysis I just would like you to go ahead and click the link here and see my technical analysis from Friday. However, today I want to touch on a few extra points. To be more precise, a CC. I'm obsessed with them. I dislike the way they have done things. I don't believe that we really need Bitcoin ETF. And most definitely, I personally believe that SEC is trying to do what they claim Bitcoin is doing themselves, manipulation. So, dear SEC, if you believe that crypto market is being manipulated, stop freaking manipulating it. So, we don't need your ETF decisions. We don't need your so-called approval. We don't need your technical expertise. Unfortunately, you have none of them. So, since you don't have any of those things, so stop putting your finger through it and trying to scare people off. Cryptocurrencies are more stable than the US dollar, they are more stable than Euro, they are more stable than any other fiat currencies out there for the fact that you can print as many of it as you want and you will always get along with it or get away with it. However, cryptos are always going to be quite limited. Even those of excuse my language, but shit coins for me is more stable than looking into some of those of fiat currencies. Look at the Venezuela. So the currency died, thank you US, probably you had something to do with it. Look at Turkish Lira, it's dying. It's every time that I go to Turkey, every week that I go to Turkey pretty much, the, the, the prices are changing, people are are basically struggling to have their ends meet for the fact that their salaries are still with old Turkish Lira but the imports are done from abroad and they need to pay in euros and dollars so people of universe cryptos are here to stay and they are our refuge so SEC Bitcoin prices are not manipulated you are the manipulator so stop manipulating it. Now, if you do agree with me, comment your approval or agreement with me in the comments. And please do share this video. Let's make this be heard by the rest of the people. It's not that crypto lovers are money launderers. It's not that crypto traders are doing some kind of criminal activities. Now, I want to also touch on the banks. So dear banks, if you are freaking afraid that cryptos are gonna take your job away or money away, stop fighting it and stop inter uh, start integrating it. Barclays, HSBC, these have started to ban and limit some of the people's bank accounts in the UK. Many other banks all over the world, they, they started to ban people's bank accounts, seize their bank account, or stop any kind of transaction in it. Banks, we trust our money with you. You are not my money's owner. I am my money owner. I earned that money, so it's in my sole discretion on whatever the hell I want to do with it. So get along with it, start approving or start getting along with what I do. If you believe that you own my, my money, goodbye for you, I will not put my money or yet alone a penny with you. Please piss off, would you? Now, let's touch on cryptos, because I hear a lot of the people commenting that, oh, it's end of the world, shitcoins here, I don't know, altcoins there, Bitcoin here, people, you need to understand what each coin start or stands for. 
I personally believe that there are a lot of blockchain applications out there that are feasible. And of course there are a lot of the shit coins and thank you shitcoin pumpers. Shit coins exist because of you. If it wasn't you last year putting your money for everything that said crypto on it, we wouldn't have had this kind of discussion nowadays. So you need to, as potential so-called investor with $500, start reading a little bit and educating yourself before expecting a moon. Of course I want to have a moon. Of course I would like to see cryptos go trillion dollar market cap. But if you don't educate yourself, trillion market cap will never happen. But if we start educating each other, stop fighting each other. Here is a note for McAfee as well. Dear McAfee, I like what you do, but stop fighting with people. Start making friends. Enemies, it's very easy to make. You need to make friends, my friend. You are a great guy. I love the way you think, but the way you are creating haters around you is not really helping anybody, including yourself. Now, I also want to touch base some of the ICOs that are coming up, but not, not in today's video. I will be inviting, as I said last time, some of the ICOs to an interview so that we can actually make them or break them. So if you want me to ask certain questions, let me know, please, so that I can go ahead and break the hell out of them if they are worth being broken. None of my videos, by the way, are not sponsored. I don't get paid in any of these things. I'm not planning to be paid any, in any of those things. And I don't have any conflict of interest, not like many other people. So I want you, yes you, to be educated. I want to share some of my wisdom with you and perhaps learn from your comments for myself as well. There are seven coins that I truly believe in right now besides Ether, Bitcoin and perhaps Stellar. So I have 10 coins that I truly believe in. I'm not talking of those of ERC20 tokens, coins we are talking of. And I will be sharing about them in some of my upcoming videos as well. This was Yegu Brahimov from a to Z markets.com and I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to please share this video, write your comment and press that like button. We need your support in order to make this community grow. Have a great one.